Hello everyone and welcome back to another zombie apocalypse series and in today's video we are now in an abandoned in an abandoned town or city you could say I guess it's like a village but yeah we're like in an abandoned village or town I guess it's more like a village to be honest in my opinion and this is all made by me this took me three days three or four days and as you can see Nick like here is like abandoned station our home of course we have like one of the biggest what on earth and then we also then have like a few other houses here I think I showed it last episode and saw at the end of last episode so yeah last episode we, we had a crazy episode because everyone had to leave because zombies have literally taken over the shopping center so we're safe now hopefully so we're gonna go inside okay so inside the house it's a very big house i guess it has the, the slight thunder and lightning um and inside the house is very bare and we also got it upstairs too so i gotta admit this is like one of the biggest houses in the neighborhood so you know go bigger go home kind of vibe so as you can see, this is kind of how it looks. It's kind of really, really big. I don't really know what they're gonna do because there's like hardly any furniture in here and money is a very big problem with me. Okay, so I actually forgot to paint the ceilings. My bad. But these guys are gonna put their sleeping bag right down here. So these two, I guess, are gonna sleep up heat downstairs, you know, to be on lookout. Finley has gone into the kitchen to do his little like cooking. He's like literally the um okay, the chef. I was gonna say he's like an awesome chef, but um yeah, he doesn't know what to do. <laughs> but yeah, he is like though he's like the father or the like main one to cook for the thing, even though he is awful I don't I don't know. I'm not gonna bad talk him, but yeah, outside is kind of like chaos is wet and very stormy hopefully yeah everyone's just hungry i don't really we don't have much money so buying stuff here is bad and oh my god there's like zombies now coming around oh she's actually very pretty okay so i think upstairs i'm gonna say that joji kind of i don't know like, took it from his old house even though i think it was last time it's green but hey you know and then i think they also found these outside i'm just gonna just, you know bear with me when i say this they just kind of found these randomly probably outside um yeah outside i could have painted the ceilings actually maybe i should do that i have just put down thingies finn's mat and the others and then her mat is upstairs they all look very sad and i think food's ready Hopefully there's enough servants for everyone because I just asked everyone to grab a servant and I don't know if there's going to be enough. Okay, there's not enough for Jodie. So everyone just sat down together. I think it's better now because there's like hardly anyone here. And they're all together inside a abandoned home. I guess this like could have been a factory maybe or just a dumping ground. I have no idea. Anyway, so this is like a complete dumping ground i guess kind of like i guess it could have been a factory like it could have been a big factory but the likelihood of that is very low it's very tired finn of course is now really sad probably they all scared of the lightning because literally look at the horrible weather out here like this is a zombie apocalypse happening and the weather is awful oh look at lorelei just like helping out like lorelei is such a sweet angel sometimes georgie has to make his own food now because of course finley made one short okay so everyone's just doing a little thing now a lot of them are tired so i think amara's in bed now and of course lorelei is also going to bed okay so of course Mary Ella is gonna compliment him, be like, hey, you're really nice today, like, you're very handsome, like, always. You know, just trying to, like, make him happy and be like, and he'd be like, yeah, like, thank you so much, like, you, you look good too, like, Finn's just here now, oh, he doesn't look very happy at all. But Mary Ella's probably gonna get up and be like, okay, someone's at the door and I really need to know who. 
So a young handsome man is at the door. Of course there is a zombie around the area. Okay, so she's gonna be like, oh hello, like he's like, hey, like I'm a neighbor from that house over there. Wait, that house over there. Um, my name is Harland. I'm Harland, like, nice to meet you. Uh I, I just wanted to say hi, like, hello. And she'd be like, okay. Um, I think she'd be like, okay, um, let's go inside, like, before anything else happens, like, come and follow me in the house. Okay, so these two are gonna come in. He, he just did a twirl then. But these two have now come into the house fully. And Finn probably a bit jealous. Now, this is not, like, but Finn probably, like, have a big crush on Mary Ella. Like, it started to grow and grow now, so... He's probably have, like, he literally looks jealous and annoyed. So he probably be jealous that, you know, this other man is now in the house and he's very, like, he looks very close to um, Mary Ella and he's not very happy. He probably, like, like you know, secretly, like, why, why is he here? Like, he's a bit more handsome than me. Like, you know, kind of worried. So, because these two are wet, I think she'd be like, hey, like, take a seat, like, make yourself at home. Like, uh, I guess it'd be the kind of rough to be in a living in apocalypse at the moment. So, Harlan probably be like, hey, like, I'm from this neighborhood. Like, I, I kind of like, you're really pretty. Like, have anyone told you this? Like, you know, um, if you need any help, like, I'm, I'm, like, happy to help you in any point of, like, the area. Um... Like, I also have some furniture, like, if you want better beds than this, like, I I'm happy to give you some of my stuff. Like, I got money, I'm, I'm like, loaded, like, literally, like, more loaded than anyone else probably be. And, you know, it's kind of rough, like, this neighbourhood is probably, like, the worst neighbourhood you can ever live in, and I kind of want to help you. And then, like, Mary Alice, like, oh my god, like, thank you so much, like, me and my friends are definitely gonna be, like, happy about this. And he'd be like, you know, it's like, oh, like, the zombies have been a problem. Like, loads of people used to live here, like, a few months ago. And now, like, a few days ago, like, everyone just left. Like, after, like, the apocalypse hit, everyone just left. And now it's just become a, like, rotten, like, town. Like, no one lives here. No one stays here. Me and my bud, like, over in the other house are, like, the only men now. Or only, like people in general now like the only people who are like living here now like everyone else is just gone like all the kids all the families like hardly anyone is around you like you know you kind of like you know we kind of just you know we need to work together this apocalypse is happening like I I i'm like not really scared because i kind of like knew this is gonna happen at some point you know, you know and of course finley would be like very jealous at the moment he kind of just looks i know this is intent but please pay along um he's kind of just like probably jealous because he likes mariella and of course she's like getting closer with this like guy that he doesn't even know the name of yet his actual name is harlan so this is harlan and this is finn and finn's probably be like you know probably like he'll put his hand on his necklace there because that the deeper meaning of his necklace is that it was given by his father so the key was given by his father and that like other part of his necklace i think it's like a tooth i think it's a tooth i'm not really sure but that was given by his mother and of course because those two are gone now he's probably just like really upset because he fancies a girl now and he's never like he probably just doesn't know what to do whilst his sister of course has been with loads of guys and look at these like these guys are really going along and he's like this is the worst like why would he t try and take like the girl i kind of have a crush on like how could i tell her that i like her you know but of course they she probably won't even listen to him today anyway or anytime because of course look at how she's looking at harland okay no ignore this part but how she was looking at harland she was like yeah like she's like smiling at him they kind of getting along so he'd probably be like hey like you know you kind of like this is very scary of course because like apocalypse is everyone will be scared of fuck so these guys are kind of getting closer i guess i kind of like starting to gain feelings because i gotta admit he is attractive i mean mm, but there is some secrets that they don't know about this man yet 
But of course, Finley is definitely gonna get jealous because you know he's. I know he has his back to him, but of course, please play along. So Harlan probably be talking about the town like. So this town needs to be busy, like very busy, or like. There was loads of girls around, loads of men around, loads of kids around also. And unfortunately, some of them have turned into zombies and others have fled the city or the town. Because, like, he probably noticed how they dressed and be like, hey, like, you're definitely not from here. Like, you're more dressed like a, like, I don't know, more like of a artsy type of person or like someone who just, you know, I don't know like casual and she's like yeah we're not from here like we're from samashuna like you're really pretty like honestly like i i just can't get you on my brain at the moment and she's like oh thank you like you know and of course finley is in a very jealous state at the moment he is not very happy what he's hearing he's just like and look at the dog, look at the husky com comforting him. He's so jealous, like, he looks a bit jealous at the moment. Probably he has like a secret crush on, like, of course, as I mentioned, he probably, he has a crush on her. And it only started coming today, and of course, he can just hear him, like, be like, Oh, you should definitely check out my place, like, we can, like, literally have the best, like, time of our lives. Like, just talking, and then, of course, you know, she's, like, giggling with him, like, oh my god like i can't believe like i've actually found someone else too like it is so scary just to find like someone else but of course he has like secrets that they don't really know but um you know i'm gonna leave that a little bit longer for you guys so haha <laughs> um and she'd be probably like he'd be like telling her like how much he loves this town and how big beautiful it was before so he's kind of like more like he actually also covering up his tattoos because i'm gonna say like maybe some people don't really want you to and oh my god look at this this is so cute so these guys he's decided to ask her to lay on his lap and he's so cute together okay this is cute so romance is definitely in the air okay and then that happens and of course, probably Finley isn't really listening, but he, he can hear her giggling, be like, you know, happy kind of like. And I think, you know, they're kind of getting really close. And I think Finley's very jealous because, you know, he was really close with Mary Ella when I was at the shopping center. And now she's completely like met this new guy who she's just like, you know, it's like Anna from Frozen. Like, you know, like she just met Hans and now she's like in love with this man. Like, he was like, uh, like, this is, like, way too fast. Like, something's going on. Like, something has to be going on. You know, like, he's a bit suspicious. So, because Finley doesn't really want to hear the little, like, story, he's going to be go to sleep. And, of course, these guys are, like, being cute together, you know. And completely, they just met, like, Elsa, as I just said, like, Anna and Elsa. Lorelai's going to the bathroom. Oh, my God, look at those two giggling together. So, of course, these guys, he's just gonna, like, tickle her, you know, like, kind of be, like, kind of cute together. I think this is, like, a more kisses mod or something like that. I feel like Harlem, like, hey i'm gonna go now like see you guys tomorrow like i love you bye bye you know kind of jazz so how long's gonna go they're kind of flirting with each other so she's probably like oh no please don't go and he'd be like yeah well i have to you know my buddy my friend wants me like you know we got like dealios we're not like that close like and then bye. Like, I feel like Finley's gonna hide his feelings, but at the moment he's gonna sit next to it and be like, hey, like, what's that man's deal? Like, Harlan, like, you two was getting a bit close. Not mind me asking, like, what was that? She was like, oh, it's nothing, you know, like, he's kind of cute, you know? And Finley would be like, cute, like, you know, like, fuming inside, like, he'd be like, cute. <laughs> so he's kind of like, cute what like what what is her deal like she just met this guy and she's like i really like you know he's kind of handsome like he's really nice like i don't see like the problem or a point or anything like you know it's kind of like really exciting you know and like he's like the best guy and she's like yeah we just moved into this town and you like this guy who you just met a frozen weapon 
<laughs> I'm joking. But it's kind of like, you know, fast. So I think Lorelai is gonna come upstairs, as you can see. So she's gonna be like, sorry, like, Lorelai, like, I really am stressed at the moment. Like, you know, I'm really sorry. And she would be like, you know, the storm is like literally, and demon, uh, the, demon, the, the vamp, <laughs> <laughs> the zombies are getting like really bad and I'm kind of worried and she'd be like oh it's okay like Jodie that like, I'm really like kind of worried as well this place is kind of run down to be honest she's very angry at the moment but that's because she's test tense so he'd be like don't like don't worry like I got you like I'm gonna protect you no matter what and of course they kind of like you know so cute so, like, why why <laughs> They're so cute together. Honestly, I do ship these two. To the city streets, we begin to feel the fire. I think I'm gonna add all the mods down below in the link. So if you wanna try these for yourself, I will link them down. As the chemicals that take us higher. The nights are so it has just begun. Lorelai hasn't changed out this outfit like for ages. We wanna chase the night, wanna dance to the light, pull stars from the sky, just two hearts running wild. Never sleep, never stop. Every shot from the top, we're gonna, we're gonna be two hearts running wild. And then I guess to end this episode, these guys are gonna be dating. So these guys are official and I'm gonna admit I do love this episode so much. Thank you so much for watching and I really appreciate everything. So thank you so much and see you all in another video. Goodbye for now.